Experts always encourage bee attack victims to call 911 for help. But what happens if bees don't attack but leave you a virtual hostage in your own home to avoid them? Who do you call then? One Edinburgh woman thought her fire department would help. She was wrong. Tonight, her call for action brings answers and results. The front of Perla Aleman's Edinburgh home looks like this. Doors shut, kids inside, no real signs of life. But that's only because of what's buzzing along her fence line. Thousands of bees have moved in. I don't let them outside because if we do, we have to be in a certain area of the house. With no money for pest control, Perla thought she could rely on the Edinburgh Fire Department for help. They said that they couldn't help me. She's told that because nobody has been stung. But Perla is trying to avoid that. Frustration swarms over her with recent news of what can happen when bees attack. Because I've heard of incidents where people actually have died from a bee sting. To help keep her family safe, Action 4 News calls for help. Adrian Esparza Jr., a third generation professional with Esparza Pest Control, determines the area is safe. The bumblebees have no home, no hive, and he says pose little risk if left undisturbed. His father, Adrian Esparza Sr., explains why. I mean, I'm right next to thousands of bees right now. All they're doing is pollinating. The news is a relief to Perla. But it's even more encouraging for her to learn how Edinburgh firefighters didn't choose to turn their backs on her problem with bees as she first feared. Acting Fire Chief Ubaldo Perez meets with her at our request. Thank you very much. The City of Edinburgh Fire Department does not have a license issued by the state to do any type of pest control. Um, the only time that we do uh, assist the citizens is when they are being attacked because that is now a life safety issue, whether it be a person or an animal, we will respond immediately. Thanks to, you know, our communication with, you know, Channel 4 News, now I understand that they have life-threatening situations, you know, and now the Special Pest, Pest Control came and they, they saw the situation, so we're better, more comfortable knowing that it's just nature taking its course. If a problem is stinging you, one call can bring relief. Edinburgh firefighters responded to about 200 cases of bee attacks last year alone. They say responding to an incident where someone hasn't been stung only pulls valuable manpower and resources away from a potential life-threatening situation. As far as the pest control has an app you can use to get fast results with identifying a bee hazard at your home. Do you have a problem you'd like for me to address? Just tell me about it on my Facebook page. It's really easy to find me. Just search Ryan Wolf. I'm on Facebook chatting with people right now.